Today we're going to make this Father's Day card. For today's craft you're going to need some scissors, some glue, a pencil, some markers, crowns, or pencil crowns. Today I'm using black and brown. You um, definitely need brown and then you can use any other color you would like for the writing. I have some googly eyes. If you don't have googly eyes you could always just make your eyes out of uh, white paper and black paper. You're going to need some paper for your card and then paper for your owl, whatever colors you would like. So the first thing you want to do is pick the color you want for your card. And I want white as the background for my card, so I'm using a white piece of paper. You choose what you would like. I'm going to take my card and I'm going to put it long side left to right, short side top to bottom. I'm going to fold the left over to the right and that is going to be my card. But I want to work on it the other way so I'm just going to flip it so that it lifts up this way. So it lifts, sorry, sorry, you can get that, <laughs> like that. So I can pull bottom to top. This will be the inside of my card where I can write a message, draw a picture, anything I would like. We're going to work on the outside of our card today. The first thing I want to do is I want to prepare for looking at my card to see which side I want my owl on and which side I want my message. I think I'm going to put my message on this side and my owl on this side. You get to decide what you want to do and then I'm going to write my message. Now you might want to use a pencil first so that if you make any mistakes you can correct it. I'm going to use a marker just so that you can see better. And I'm going to do mine in black, but you could do yours in whatever color and multiple colors when you're done. It's up to you. I'm going to write, you're a hoot, dad, right, because we're doing an owl. Once you have your message and you've colored it any way that you would like, we're going to do the other side. So on this side, we're going to create an owl using the paper that we have, and we're going to put our owl on a little... Um, tree branch, that's why I'm using brown. So I'm going to use a brown marker. You could use a brown pencil or pencil crown as well. You could also just cut it out and glue it on if you don't have a, a marker, crown, or a pencil crown. So I'm just going to create a little branch that goes off the side of my page. And you can see it's just a, or a, a line that's not quite straight, comes down and up. And then I'm going to come this side and do the same thing. Your branch can look any way that you would like and just color it in. Now we're going to make our owl to sit on that branch. This is where you get to choose whatever colors you would like for your owl. I would like to use blue as the main body of my owl, so I'm going to fold my piece of paper over. So once I folded that piece of paper, I'm going to find that fold line. I'm going to put my pencil down and I'm going to do a little scoop up, come down, and I'm going to curl back in the bottom. So here you can see a little scoop is just kind of like a little curved line that comes up, comes down, and it folds at the bottom. And I'm going to cut that out. When I open that up, I have my owl. Just want to make sure it fits okay. Yeah, I like that size, so that's going to be the body of my owl. I'm going to take my orange piece of paper and I'm going to fold it over. Once again, I'm going to go to that fold line and I'm going to draw a diagonal line and then back in like a triangle. So that's one thing. And then I'm also going to do the feet here. To do that, I'm going to go right in the center here and I'm going to draw a nice big curve around and then kind of a little a uh, curve in, another curve in, and a third curve in. So I'm going to cut those out in a minute, but might as well use my yellow piece. So they, these are going to be the little um, wings on the side. I'm going to fold that in half, and I'm going to start at the top here. I'm going to draw a curve line around to the bottom, go back to the top, and draw another curve line around to the bottom. And there we go. I'm going to cut everything out and then I'm going to assemble it all and glue it on. Now these are going to be my googly eyes. Remember if you don't have any, just use white paper. So cut a circle out with white paper and then draw a little pupil in the middle and that will be just fine. So go ahead and cut out all your pieces and then you can start assembling them. And once you have your little owl 
all assembled. You can glue it right on your page. Now you've got your uh, hoot dad. Your card is ready to go. You can open it up and like I said earlier, you can write a message. You can draw a picture and a poem, anything that you would like on the inside and you have your card. If you like this craft, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for joining me on Craft Club for Kids. Remember, be creative and have fun.